I'm trading my sorrows I'm trading my shame I'm laying them down for the joy of the Lord I'm trading my sickness I'm trading my pain I'm laying them down for the joy of the Lord We say yes Lord Yes Lord, yes Lord, yes, yes Lord Yes Lord, yes Lord, yes, yes Lord Yes Lord, yes Lord, yes, yes Lord Amen I'm trading my sorrows, I'm trading my shame, I'm laying them down for the joy of the Lord. I'm trading my sickness, I'm trading my pain, I'm laying them down for the joy of the Lord. Yes, Lord, yes, Lord, yes, yes, Lord. Yes, Lord, yes, Lord, yes, yes, Lord. Yes, Lord, yes, Lord, yes, yes, Lord. Amen. Yes, yes, Lord, amen. I'm pressed but not crushed, persecuted, not abandoned, struck down but not destroyed. I'm blessed beyond the curse for his promise will endure and his joy is gonna be my strength. Though this sorrow may last for the night, his joy comes in the morning. I'm trading my, I'm trading my shame. I'm laying them down for the joy of the Lord. I'm trading my sickness, I'm trading my pain, I'm laying them down for the joy of the Lord. We say yes, Lord, yes, Lord, yes, Lord, yes, Lord, yes, yes, Lord. Hallelujah to your name, O oh Lord. We praise you, Father. You're the healer divine, O oh Lord. That's right. Thank you, Lord. You're the sweet rose of Sharon. Yes, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. You're Jehovah Jireh, my provider. Thank Lord. you, Father. Oh, we love you, O oh Jesus. Thank you so much, Lord. Father, we cherish your name today. We sing from our hearts, oh Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Deep within our souls, it will give you praise. Yes, Father. Worthy, 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 worthy. Make us a new, oh Lord. Yes, Father. Redeem every part of our hearts. Yes, Father. Make us like gold in your presence. Yes, Father. And come and give us your rest, oh Lord Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you for the Sabbath, oh Lord. Thank you, Father. Father, we honor you today. Yes, we do, Jesus. Oh, Lord 
Lord, you are here today. Your presence is here today. Thank you, Father. How great you are, oh Lord. Thank you, Father. Just believe the Lord is saying there is a, an opened heaven here today. An open portal of heaven. That just breathe in. God knows our sorrows. He knows our pains today. He knows the difficulties today. And today, he just wants us to lay them down before him at the cross. Just to trust him with them. To know that he's speaking into them. I have a sense of his healing power here today as well. And he just wants us to draw on his healing power today. Just breathe in the presence of Jehovah Rapha, the Lord our healer. The presence of Jehovah Jireh, the Lord who sees and provides. And just draw on your strength today, Lord. Jehovah Sidkenu, the Lord, our righteousness. Lord, without you, we're nothing, but through you, Father God, we receive forgiveness. We receive righteousness. We thank you. Just draw on his strength today. He knows our situations. I believe the anointing, the presence of God is here. So if you could just sense... As you breathe in his presence today, the anointing of the Holy Spirit in your spirit, in your mind, in your heart, on your body actually. For some of you are feeling physically the anointing of the presence of God on your body. That's an open heaven this morning. We just are so grateful to you, Jesus, for your love for us. We need you to lift us up to that higher place. We need you to take us, God, into your arms, to take us into that place where you are surrounding us. And you're with us. And we want to thank you today for your love for us. Forgive us, Lord, for our times of forgetfulness, our times of rebellion. Forgive us, Lord, as we repent, we turn to you and say, Lord, we want you. Forgive us, Lord. We turn to your, you. We want you and only you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. We lay it all at the cross. The splendor of the King, clothed in majesty, let all the earth rejoice, let all the earth rejoice. He wraps himself in light, and darkness too high and trembles at his voice and trembles at his voice how great is our God sing with me how great is our God all will see how great how great is our God And age to age, and age to age, he stands. Time is in his hands. Yeah. Our God and me in one. Father, Spirit. Lion and the land. How great is our God? And sing with me, how great is our God? And all will see how great, how great is our God. Oh, how great is our God? above all names. It's the name above all names. Worthy of Thank you, Lord. my heart will sing how 
Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Holy Father, we praise you. Um, when we were worshipping, I just got the sense that God was saying that some people in here are feeling heavy, um, heavy burdened. And Matthew 11, verse 28 says, Come to me, all you who are weary and heavy burdened, and I will give you rest. Take my yoke upon you and learn from me, for I am gentle and humble in heart, and you will find rest for your souls. For my yoke is easy, and my burden is light. And I just got the sense that God's saying that sometimes people are kind of striving for perfection, and God's saying, no, just rest in me. But from a place of knowing who you are, from a place of peace, step forward and push for a stand of excellence. Don't strive for perfection, and through him you can push for a stand of excellence. And I just felt God wanting to speak to you about the different spheres of your lives, about um, rest and finance and maturing in Christ. And God's saying, sometimes you feel like you're struggling in these different areas, um, particularly I feel a sense of people struggling in the area of finance. And I felt God saying, keep going. He's going to bring breakthrough. There's blessing and favor in that area. Isaiah 43 verse 16 set, talks about how God made a way through the sea. He parted the Red Sea and the Israelites walked through. And I feel like God's saying he's going to bring miracles and favor and blessing. He's going to make a way in the area of finance and he just wants to encourage you to keep on doing what it says in Matthew 6 verse 33 keep on seeking first the kingdom of God and all his righteousness and everything else will be added to you as well amen thank you Lord let's keep just listening to those words coming to him all who are weary and heavy laden he will give you rest for some of us it's as God said, financial situations. Some of us, it's just emotional or relational situations. God says he's healing your heart today. Just receive his healing as you come to him, letting go of heavy hearts, forgiving, releasing, and allowing his presence to come in as we repent, as we forgive, as we release. So the presence of God comes and dwells in the center of our hearts, our emotions, gives us freedom from our spirits. Thank you, Lord.
Sometimes I feel protected and in his arms. I feel protected in his arms. Never it's connected in his arms. I feel protected. There's no place I'd rather. Falling in love, oh, in Jesus. Falling in love with Jesus, oh. Falling in love with Jesus was the best thing. Falling in love, falling in love with Jesus. Falling in love with Jesus. Wow, falling in love, oh, with Jesus. Was the best thing I've ever, ever done. Was the best thing I've ever, ever done. Yes, Lord, we love you. It was the best thing I've ever, ever done. Thank you, Lord. Praise you, Lord. We worship you, O Father. We glorify your name, O Lord. Thank you, Lord. You are here today, O oh Lord, to show us your love. He's here today, oh, falling in love with Jesus. Falling in love with Jesus was the best thing I've ever, ever done. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. It was the, the best, best thing I've ever, ever done. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Oh, oh. Best thing I've ever, ever, ever done. Thank you, Lord. We're going to just uh, sing that again. And this time we want to change the words to I feel protected to I am protected, just Amen. as a declaration of faith. So let's just sing that again. You know, declaring that Jesus is with us and that he has protected us. Amen. In his arms, I am protected. In his arms, never disconnected. In his arms, I am protected. There's no place I'd rather, rather be. Let's sing that again. Hallelujah. In his arms. I am protected in his arms, never disconnected. Whoa, in his arms, I am protected. There's no place I'd rather, rather be. Whoa. There's no place I'd rather. There's no place I'd rather, rather be. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Amen. Praise you, Jesus. We just Thank worship you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Church, just let's 
Let's lift up our hearts and Thank our you, mouths Lord. unto Thank the you, Lord. Jesus. You know what you've gone through this week. Thank you, Lord. Bring it before the Lord. Thank you, Jesus. We bless As you, you empty your heart. We worship you, Jesus. Praise Let's give you, thanks Lord. and praise unto praise the Lord. Praise you, Lord. Praise you, Lord. Praise you, Lord. Thank you, Holy Thank Father. Thank you, Father. Thank you, Heavenly Thank you, Father. Lord. Praise God. I thank just thank you, Lord. I just sensed as we sang that, that, that I am protected. I just sensed the arms Hallelujah. of Jesus, the Amen. arms of the Father just coming right round us, being pleased in his heart that we are declaring his truth, declaring who he is and what he's done. And I just sensed that sense of God's protective arms around us. So thank you, Lord. Let's thank him for that. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you Father. Amen. Praise thank you, God. Father. We praise you, Lord. Amen. Thank you that your love is here, Lord. Thank you, Father, that you love us so much, Lord Jesus. So much to die for us on the cross, oh Lord. Worship you, Jesus. Your kingdom triumphs over. 
God is reminding us of the things he has said to us uh, over the last year or so about bringing everything to him, submitting to him, about obedience to him, that he's bringing his cleansing fire, he's bringing his purifying water, that we're to be connected to him in union with him, fiercely um, obeying him, fiercely living for him, because this is a time that God wants to move us, he wants to move us up a level. He wants to move us up and on in our lives. And some of us have been feeling the, the, the growing pains. Some of us have been feeling the growing pains. We're being challenged to change. We're being challenged to change. But it's because that's growing pains. He has a greater vision for your life. He has a greater vision for your family. He has a greater vision for your destiny and for everything he has for you. So God says to us today, lay everything at the feet of Jesus and then come alive in the name of Jesus. Lay everything at the feet of Jesus in obedience, and then come alive in the name of Jesus. 